I'd love to see. We've had 41 minutes 50 seconds. We must be we're into injury time. Can Salford hang on? A Warrington going to find this extra extra yard of space that is going to give them a final try and, and do something with this game. It's a drop goal attempt. He's charged down and he's picking, picked up by George Grant. So Salford, I've got to hang out again. Warrington, I've got to get this ball out wide as fast as they can. Down to Bob Jackson. Warrington spinning it out. It's on there to Gregory. Gregory's making a play on his own. He's got players there. He's got to hand it on this time to Ellis. And then Ellis going to go under the post. Ellis is going to score. And Ellis makes the score. Wellington 20, Salford 20. And that was a superb break there. And one has to feel very, very proud of, uh, of Gregory and Ellis. But so sad, really, for the Salford supporters. That's 20 apiece. The goal kick to come. Who's going to win this game now? Oh, it's going to be Warrington. But we really must have another look at that final pass when we see the video. It seemed to our eyes as though it was forward. The referee wasn't up to see it. And the race to the line was all over for Ellis when he got there. What a tremendous result for Warrington. They're going to win this now, obviously. The league season with a win here. But what a superb game of rugby league. And Salford really must be rather sick there standing behind the post. They can't really believe now. But they may well go back to the Willows tonight <coughs> after having lost 22-20. And he kicks the goal, that's 22 points to 20. We're waiting here for the Hooter here at Willowsville Stadium. I don't know where the Hooter's gone, the, the noise here is quite deafening from I would imagine about 4,500 and 5,000 fans here at Willowsville Stadium. There goes the Hooter. Final score here, 22-20 to Warrington. I'll hand over to Steve for his final summary.